Good day and greetings from Ra Cha Cha Chester, New York. There it is, everybody. That is my new uh, windshield mount. I believe it is set up for an iPhone, but uh, making it work. Found this in a clearance bin up in Potsdam, New York, the other day for three bucks. So I thought I'd give it a shot. Not sure what I'm going to uh, do with this as far as vlogging goes, but uh, that's just something else to play with for now, right? And uh, I took a moment and did a uh, half-assed job of uh, cleaning my windows and mirrors while I was sitting here. Uh, is the beer 30 yet? Oh, the steering wheel's in the way. Okay, yeah. It's Friday. All right, that's the out here, Ra Cha Cha Chester. I moved them out a little bit. Half ass cleaned the glass and the windshield. Now I'm going to pull out of here. Go pull off to the side and inspect the inside of the trailer. Make sure there's no holes or wet spots or anything like that. And then, uh, gotta come and see where I'm off to next. It does get a little busy in here occasionally. I do come here uh, frequently. Going to go over the old speed bump, they bump, they bump, they bump, they bump. Do the bump, right? Is that how the song went? I think that's how it went. Something like that. Alright, I gotta go make this happen. Well, the trailer looks about as good as it's gonna get. And. I just found out what my next mission is. I'm going to roll on over to Canandaigua, New York, pick up a load for Perth Amboy, New Jersey, take it back to the yard in Syracuse. Uh, I kind of need these to see where I'm going, right? And then, uh, that might be it for today. I don't know. I might have to drag this out a little bit. <laughs> you can do that when you get paid by the hour, you know, make a little extra money. So, uh, Alright, I'm going to get rolling here. Dropping and hooking, hooking and dropping, dropping and hooking, trailers that is. Dropping and hooking, hooking and dropping, dropping, hooking, dropping, hooking, dropping, hooking, trailers. Canadaigua, New York. Oh boy. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Is it me? Or does this look kind of fresh? This looks kind of fresh. That's awesome. Like, I really wanted to deal with something like this today. Oh, boy. And now I have to go inside and find somebody to file a report with on the damage on the trailer that I got here. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Okay, so here's the situation, and it doesn't involve my parents going away on a week's vacation. I went in and talked to the shipping clerk, told him the situation with the trailer, that there was some damage. I showed him the pictures, and he told me that unless we have pictures that prove that that damage was not there before we dropped it here, there's nothing they can do about it. All right. So he told me I needed to take those pictures, send them to whoever I've got to send them to at my company, then have them contact the transportation office here or their customer service representative and let them know what's going on. All right. 
right? Pretty easy, right? So I called down the HQ, talked to my dispatcher, told her what was going on, told her about the conversation I had with the, the shipping clerk. She says, okay, hold on a few minutes. All right. Calls back, and they want a phone number for the guy that I talked to. So I go back inside, get a phone number, so that they can verify, I guess, what I'm telling them is the truth, maybe? I don't know. I just do what I'm told. All I know is that I could have been out of here about an hour and 20 minutes ago without all this nonsense. But I had to do the right thing and report it because the next person who hooks up to this trailer could call down there and say, hey, this trailer has damage on it, and then it comes back on me. So I'm just basically CYA, cover your ass. Ooh, that wasn't good. <laughs> that sounded like a duck, didn't it? Sound like a duck to me. Alright, we're going to do this the way it was meant to be. Driving through the yard, trying to loosen my load. I got Bob's World's videos on my mind. Something about that blue bus, something about that blue bus that just drives me so flipping crazy. And that doesn't rhyme. Take it easy. Take it e easy. Don't let the sound of my terrible voice drive you crazy. All right, you know what time it is? Time for the bestest gosh darn sound in the world right there. That's the time it was. Back here in Syracuse, done for the day. Of course, uh, once I was told that I was done, I uh, sent a text to my ex, letting her know that I was almost done. Uh, it's her weekend with my son this weekend. And I asked her what time she wanted him home. And then just after I sent that text, my dispatcher told me to hold on a minute. They might be sending me out to Baldwinsville to pick up a load. But the empty trailer they wanted to send me with is... Uh, Needs two new tires that have been flat spotted and they're, there's a spot right down to the cords. So I can't take that over there and leave that like that. And then I talked to uh, my ex again and apparently she's picking them up tomorrow morning after she gets done with the gym. What she said she told me before but I must have forgotten. It happens. But uh, yeah, I'm all done. I'm going to uh, wrap things up here then uh, go home get something to eat and uh, maybe have a few frosty barley pops later and uh, find some uh, mischief and mayhem to get into this weekend. So, until next time, I will catch y'all later. Y'all have a good one, eh? I am out here. Hasta la pasta.